What's up YouTube, this is Prince of ATP 101 and in this video I want to show you guys another 20 plus tweaks that works for the 11.2 to 11.3.1 jailbreak and also 11.4 beta 1 to 3. So if you're already jailbroken, you're fine. Links in the description for the jailbreak video and also at the end of this video there will be some tweaks videos in the corner up here and at the bottom. So yeah, the first tweak I want to show you guys is called buy separator cell. By a separator cell basically if you go to your settings there's no more lines in between like each in between each um be between each settings. Usually there's a line right there but now it's just clean. Everything is just just like that. So if you want to clean it up, there you go. Just use by separators cell and the other one is called CC less status bar so if I pull on my control center there's no status bar so that's what this does it just get rid of the status bar it just looks more clean so yeah CC less status bar and the other one is called count my messages so if I go to my messages open up so if you look up top right up top right up there you can see all my messages so it says 2901 and that's how it is right here. So right here the S is sent and there's more over here but if it was smaller then you could see the whole thing but basically tell me total, the T is for total 2901 and then the other one is sent and then you have received. So yeah, if you want to count up all your messages, you want to total up all your messages sent that's how you do it. It's called count my messages and then the other one is called fast delete key so let's go back to messages and show you how this works I'm gonna type up something real fast and I go to delete it it just deletes it real fast so basically as it says fast delete key you just delete it real fast and you could actually go into settings and set it up however you like so right now it's at max speed. You could slow it down and set it up however you like. So yeah, that one is called fast delete key. It's really, really nice. But if you have it at full speed, that might be a little bit too fast because sometimes you're texting and as soon as you tap it, like three letters are gone. So you might want to slow it down a little bit. But yeah, fast delete key. And then the other one is called Gmail Midnight. So this is like dark mode for Gmail. So if I go to my Gmail app, let it load. You can see, boom, just like that. Dark mode for Gmail. And then the other one is called Haplock. Haplock is basically haptic feedback whenever you lock your phone or open your phone. So as soon as you lock it, you get a little haptic feedback. And as soon as it's open, you also get a haptic feedback. So it's just Haplock. You can feel that little vibrate, a little pulse, like a little tap, just like that. And the iPhones, the new iPhones, like the iPhone 7 and 8 and 10, have a amazing um haptic feedback motor whatever is doing it it's it's real cool so yeah haplock and the other one is called ls gesture color ls gesture bar color so if i lock my phone you can see right here at the bottom you can see the color of the of the bar that's only on the lock screen though so if i go into an app it's regular white but when i go to the lock screen it's a different color and you could go to settings and you guys could change the color I hate respring you guys could go in there and change the color to whatever you want and then it backs out respring and now you can see it's green and then my other tweak is called no old notification text so you know if you have your if you're on your lock screen and you don't have any notification so let's swipe off let's delete all my notifications real quick so all my notifications are gone all the notifications are gone and there's no text usually it says no notification or something like that if you want to get rid of that text that's how you do it it's called no old notification text so definitely check that one out and then the other one is called nude keys if you went to if I go right here let's see that keyboard right here that red, gold, and green, that's a beautiful keyboard. So, yeah, definitely check this one out. It's called Nude Keys. You could go in there. Let's go back in the settings. Go back in the settings, and you guys could basically set it up however. You see, I have the green, then I have the yellow. 
and also the red so the red the green and the yellow so to set it up however you like and it works it definitely works one of my favorite tweaks so yeah that one is called nude keys and then the other one is called purple bar purple bar is basically whenever you put your phone into do not disturb mode the status bar should turn purple but because I, I have it modified with other tweaks it doesn't really show but if you have your phone in um, do not disturb mode the whole status bar all these all the time and all that kind of stuff should be purple but I already have it modified with um, a different tweak called battery percent X so you won't see it so install this tweak and your status bar should be purple whenever you're in do not disturb mode but I already told you I already have it modified so yeah purple bar and then the other one is called silent screenshot silent screenshot if I take a screenshot it doesn't make the sound so let's see my volume is on so if I take a screenshot it doesn't make that sound you don't get the sound that you usually get so that everybody know you took a screenshot so it's just silent and this does not block screenshot notifications so if you go to snapchat and you take a screenshot they will know only thing this does is a stop the sound stop you from hearing the sound of other people around you from hearing the stone so this do not prevent screenshot notifications so just be aware so yeah that one is called silent screenshot and the other one is called six icon dock if you look at the dock right here you can see I have six icons very simple tweak and then the other one is called seven icon dock just like six icon dock but you could put seven down there so yeah six icon dock and seven icon dock and then the other one is called smooth cursor smooth cursor is a real cool tweak that let's let go back into messages that's just it just makes the the cursor moves a lot smoother. Instead of jumping, it just glides. It just looks, it just moves a lot smoother. So, I mean, it's just smooth cursor is definitely a good tweak. I don't use it on normal occasions. I just do it for the video, but I could definitely see a lot of people using it. It's just a lot more smoother. If you like that clean, smooth look, then smooth cursor will definitely help you out and then another tweet this is not for the iPhone this is for the iPhone 8 and iPhone 7 and 6 if you're jailbroken and you want that gesture feel of the iPhone 10 then you could download this cool tweet called home gesture it just gives you that whole swipe up gesture to go home and all that kind of stuff so if you have an older device or a device that's not the iPhone 10 then you guys could try out this tweak it's called home gesture and then the other one is a Fortnite bypass I made a de dedicated video about this tweak so basically if you want to play Fortnite without having the jailbreak detection you could play it on your jailbroken device then you download this tweak it's called Fortnite bypass and you could play along the video to it will be in the description the dedicated video but yeah Fortnite bypass and then the other one is called buy beta alerts so if you're on 11.4 beta 1 or 3 or if you're on 11.3 beta then you guys could use this tweak to get rid of that notification telling you there's a new update. So let's download, buy beta alert, and then you'll be fine. There will be no more um, updates coming to your phone. You could just use your phone as normal. And then another one is called no feedback. If you have that feedback, if you're on a beta device, then a beta firmware, then you might have that little feedback app on your phone. If you want to get rid of that, just download no feedback and you'll be fine and then another one I know you guys are wondering what's that tweet that every time I touch somewhere you can see it that's called show touch everything I touch it shows up on the screen so everywhere I touch you guys could see it but it is kinda buggy I am going to tell you that right now so if I go in here show touch you can't really even though it says it's not enabled it's still working so it's kinda it needs an update to fix some of these things but you guys could change the colors and all that kind of stuff. So whatever you touch or you swipe, you could see that little dot on the screen and that's called show touch. And another one is called hide done button. So if I go right here, you see that done button up top. If you want to hide that, all you have to do is download hide done button X and, and it was gone. So it's top done. So let's download it. Let's go to Cydia. 
So this is where you get all the tweaks. You want to go on the city. You just want to hit search. Hide. Done button X. Go back. You want to hit install. And the latest do thing. So this is how you will get all your tweaks. Okay, so, so guys, so that's how you would get all your tweaks. Go on the CDS, search for it, download it, and you'll be fine. So let's go back into the wiggle mode. You can see that done is gone. So that's all you have to do. And that one is called Hide Done Button X. And another one is called Smart LPN, Smart Low Power Mode. So this is real cool. So if you plug in your device to charge it, it could go into low power mode so it charge faster. So we're going to look for it in the, in the settings. So here it is right here. So you could enable it. So when I, once I'm charged, it, then it'll go into low power mode. And all these right here, you could set it up however you like, or you could set it up to a percentage. If you reach 15 percentage battery, then the low power mode will come on. You could set it up however. It's a real cool tweak. I mean, set it up however you like. And yeah. So once I'm charging, let's see. So once I'm charging, it should be low power mode should be on but as I said it, my stuff is modified so the color doesn't really change so once you're charging you should be on but I'm already on 90 percent so all that stuff might be out of the other way but yes yeah, smart LPN definitely check it out if you're trying to conserve battery or try to charge faster all that kind of stuff and you want everything done automatic so yeah and then my other tweak is called silent record silent record is a cool tweak so if I go to my screen record you can see basically I'm recording right now but you don't see it you don't see the whole red dot and all that kind of stuff so it just looks real clean so I could stop it I could go in there I could watch it and you don't see that the red dot up top so if you want a nice clean look you can see it's playing so that's a video right there with nothing telling you that it's a um, screen record so there you go guys those are my 20 plus tweaks make sure to rate comment and subscribe it's Prince with ATP 101 paste thanks for watching